thanks Martin for the uh, introduction. And uh, good afternoon, everyone. Uh, it's uh, my great pleasure and uh, today to uh, share our research work and uh, on uh, artificial general intelligence and uh, uh, foundation models, uh, which is uh, uh, the focus of current uh, AI research. So I uh, I got my PhD degree uh, degree uh, from the uh, artificial intelligence and uh, computer science lab at MIT. So uh, and also in 2009 I joined uh, Series HK. In 2014, uh, together, uh, together with uh, Professor Tang Xiaohu, uh, we found uh, uh, established since time as a, a AI company uh, to. Uh, to try to have the AI research work, well, apply AI research work, uh, research work to industry and uh, have been work, work uh, uh, for years. And uh, for some time, uh, it was uh, uh, successfully uh, got listed at the uh, uh, stock uh, exchange of the Hong Kong on the last uh, 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 day uh, on the, uh, in uh, 2021. And um, uh, currently, I uh, have the over 6,000 uh, uh, employees, and uh, the uh, business uh, cover uh, smart uh, business, uh, smart city, smart life, smart auto, uh, different areas. And uh, also, um, in actually, uh, in last year, uh, the chairman uh, she uh, uh, visit uh, Sense Park and also went to uh, the booth of uh, uh, Sense Time, gave us a lot of uh, encouragement. And also in uh, 2018, and uh, uh, is the Minister of Science and Technology of uh, China, and uh, um, award this uh, Science Time as a uh, national open innovation platform for next uh, 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 next generation AI on the intelligent vision, and also uh, this year. Uh, our uh, CEO and also uh, together with uh, uh, Hong Kong uh, um, uh, chief exec executive and uh, uh, together visit uh, uh, the Middle East and uh, have the joint venture with uh, the Saudi to uh, expand our business. And uh, so we got uh, a lot of uh, support from the government and also from uh, from Hong Kong. And uh, uh, in the meanwhile, we are uh, established uh, uh, in 2018, uh, established, uh, found the uh, Global AI Academic uh, Aidance and uh, uh, to uh, encourage the global uh, research cooperation. Uh, so in that year, uh, there are totally uh, um, uh, 19 members uh, in this aidance, including the uh, uh, all the uh, top universities in Hong Kong, uh, the MIT, and the uh, Sydney University, and uh, so we want to, and also a lot of top universities uh, university from the mainland, and uh, to uh, uh, encourage uh, the, uh, the exchange of the research works. And so uh, today we're going to uh, share about uh, the uh, uh, artificial general, uh, general intelligence, Actually, uh, I think in the past uh, 10 years, if we give the review of the development of AI, uh, uh, starting uh, in uh, 2012, and uh, the, uh, a lot of AI research work, they uh, start to pass in the red line of uh, industrial applications. Uh, from there, there's a lot of uh, AI uh, applications in different uh, scenarios, uh, different domains. But uh, um, for different uh, research, uh, different tasks, it uh, require training different AI models. Uh, for example, uh, for since time in the past uh, several years, uh, we deliver uh, more than uh, 30,000 uh, AI models uh, for business usage. And uh, it means that um, uh, we, we uh, need a lot of uh, uh, researchers and uh, to develop a lot of uh, AI models, uh, which is uh, costly and uh, also uh, take a long time to deliver such model. So if you, you ask uh, uh, the AI researcher whether you can accomplish a certain task, uh, in many cases they will say, oh, okay, yes, but I need a lot of data. I need uh, uh, several months to train, uh, train a new model for you. And uh, so this is uh, 
a major limitation for AI uh, to have the scalable uh, applications. Uh, but uh, starting from uh, in uh, the end of uh, uh, 2022, last year, and uh, the chat GBT, they are kind of try to have the major breakthrough, uh, have the new paradigm uh, for the for AI. And uh, basically, uh, based on a very powerful foundation model, this uh, single model, uh, they can solve a lot of uh, open tasks. Uh, we don't need to build a, uh, a lot of different models. Uh, so we call this... Uh, uh, artificial general intelligence, and uh, this is a very uh, important uh, breakthrough and uh, uh, make this uh, uh, AI application scalable. And uh, this is an example of how these are uh, uh, different from the traditional AI and uh, AGI. And uh, so, uh, for example, in uh, give you the example in autonomous driving scenario, uh, if we have the picture, uh, let, let's see on the left, and uh, then. Uh, we want to uh, take certain action for the vehicle, and uh, in the uh, uh, previous AI system, uh, we have a number of uh, defined tasks. For example, we first need to do the object detection uh, to get a bounding box of the objects, and then we do need to we have the traffic sign to have the OCR uh, to recognize the the, the words uh, uh, in the bounding box. And then we have the uh, uh, decision making module and uh, to make the decision whether we want to uh, slow down on, or, or not. So in this uh, uh, pipeline, all these uh, uh, modules, uh, they are predefined, uh, they are all predefined tasks. Uh, but uh, for the uh, AGI, basically you have the very powerful uh, uh, the foundation model. Basically, you can ask uh, any questions uh, about uh, this uh, image uh, to these uh, foundation models. So uh, you 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 may you, you can ask. Uh, so uh, uh, what's the significance um, of the image and what we should do? And then this model will uh, give the explanation about the content of the image and also uh, uh, have the logic reasoning. And uh, to give the uh, give the uh, a sequence of uh, answers and uh, take the actions. So this this is uh, quite different uh, from the uh, previous AI system, uh, which uh, are all predefined uh, all the components. And uh, and we all know in the uh, uh, in the AI uh, previous AI system, we have the uh, closed data loop. Uh, basically, we have the terminal devices. And uh, it uh, um, uh, like uh, mobile phones and uh, like uh, vehicles, and uh, it will generate a lot of data and uh, send the data uh, to our model. And uh, then our model also uh, enabled enable the intelligence uh, to uh, to the terminal devices. And uh, in the meanwhile, we need to uh, uh, annotate the data. I uh, use the data to upgrade the model, and uh, we we call this as a flight wheel. And uh, but in in the uh, for the AGI, and uh, this is a kind of a, a new way uh, to generate uh, the uh, the content. So we have the powerful uh, foundation models, and uh, it, this model will have the interaction with the human. It aligns with the human intention, and also. Uh, give the prompt, it can uh, unlock a lot of uh, new skills of this uh, foundation model. In the meanwhile, this uh, foundation model will uh, generate uh, a lot of uh, uh, useful content uh, the, with the uh, wisdom. And uh, this uh, kind of, uh, uh, we call this a uh, flywheel uh, with, uh, to generate the wisdom. And this is a, a new way. So when we use, uh, have more interaction, uh, with uh, the model, the model will generate uh, more content and also use the more content to further uh, uh, make the, the foundation model stronger. And uh, uh, this uh, also uh, gives the new way and to save the, uh, 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 a lot of industrial uh, tasks. Uh, because uh, the previously we are, uh, let's uh, uh, see, the AI software probably can help us to uh, solve 20% uh, of the uh, the task, and uh, we uh, we need to build a lot of uh, uh, models uh, for specific uh, task. But now, uh, this uh, we are 
uh, based on the large, uh, powerful uh, infrastructure, and uh, we build a single model and the foundation model, and at least uh, for, uh, foundation model, uh, uh, they can also uh, can adapt to different uh, vertical domains and uh, to solve a lot of uh, open open tasks uh, through the fine tuning, and uh, which is uh, uh, much more efficient uh, than before, and it uh, can uh, solve. Uh, uh, so, uh, save 80 percent effort. Uh, for example, nowadays uh, we can use uh, the uh, foundation model to help us to improve the programming, and uh, it can. Uh, uh, we just uh, uh, the programmer uh, make a 20 percent effort, and the foundation model can gen automatically gener generate a lot of code uh, to, to help the programming, uh, largely improve the e efficiency. And this is also make uh, the model as a service possible. Because previously, uh, we people, we also hope that uh, we can uh, uh, use a, a model as a service, as a, as a business. Um, but uh, uh, on the cloud uh, platform, we, we have to serve a lot of different models. And uh, also, for a new task, uh, you always have to uh, try to train a uh, new model. So, so, so this kind of uh, uh, becomes uh, impossible uh, for model as a service. Also, it's not uh, uh, efficient. But now, uh, it's a kind of uh, different uh, with a single uh, foundation model. We can uh, uh, serve a lot of uh, different uh, tasks, uh, like uh, uh, chat GPT, GPT-4. And uh, so this uh, uh, make this uh, uh, as a possible model, as a service as a possible. So, like uh, for example, the GPT-4 itself will become the product, and uh, to provide a lot of uh, uh, service. So this is uh, going to uh, uh, largely empower the industry uh, uh, to, uh, to make the uh, AI industry market uh, grow uh, fast, and uh, also uh, uh, it's very uh, useful to uh, for the AI. Uh, to uh, try to uh, have this uh, um, handle this uh, fragmented uh, uh, industry market, and uh, very importantly, uh, in order to achieve the uh, very powerful foundation models, and there are several uh, important factors. Uh, for example, the, we need uh, a lot of uh, massive uh, clean uh, training data and uh, very high uh, computation power and uh, the, using the algorithm and also a lot of uh, engineer efforts. Uh, for example, this, uh, uh, for uh, ChatGPT, uh, it uses um, uh, uh, 45 billion uh, per training uh, data with uh, uh, the, the, uh, over uh, 500 billion uh, tokens to train the model. Currently, we are uh, using the uh, one trillion uh, uh, level the tokens to train uh, even uh, uh, stronger foundation models. And also, uh, we uh, need uh, sev uh, thousands of uh, uh, G uh, high performance uh, GPU cars, uh, like uh, A100, uh, to, uh, to train the models. Uh, let's see, now I think uh, it's a skill, even uh, skill up uh, to, let, let's see, the, the um, uh, 10,000 and uh, even uh, larger number of uh, GPUs. Uh, it's a very need a very uh, powerful uh, infrastructure on the super uh, uh, computing clusters. And also in the uh, I think in the uh, past several years, OpenAI they uh, they work on the this, uh, the GPT models and. Uh, from small uh, to bigger ones, and uh, they accumulate a lot of uh, engineer know-how. So this uh, know-how is also very important. So yeah, if you want to train um, a large uh, uh, foundation model with a, um, uh, 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 with a, uh, 100 billion parameters, uh, it's uh, not easy uh, to be successful at one uh, uh, at one uh, at once. You need to uh, accumulate a lot of uh, know-how um, uh, before that. So, in uh, with our uh, uh, infrastructure, so in the past uh, several months, we train over let's say uh, 10,000 uh, uh, models, uh, uh, like uh, 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 let's say one billion uh, parameter levels. 
and uh, we train uh, 100, over 100 models at the, with the 10 billion uh, parameters. And uh, these uh, uh, large number of uh, trainings on these models help us uh, to accumulate a lot of uh, know-how. And uh, for, for some time, we have our uh, fo uh, foundation model system. And uh, actually, we start to work on this uh, uh, foundation model since uh, 2019. And uh, first, uh, we work on the computer, uh, computer vision models. And uh, the, our uh, first uh, computer vision model um, for, for face, and uh, it has uh, 1 billion parameters. Uh, last year, we have uh, 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 our uh, largest, uh, most powerful uh, computer vision model with uh, 22 uh, billion parameters. We also uh, work on the foundation model with uh, uh, natural language processing. And uh, since uh, two, uh, 2021, and uh, so uh, currently uh, we have several uh, uh, NLP models uh, with, uh, let's see, uh, uh, over 100 uh, billion parameters. And also for uh, multi-modality models, uh, in uh, Mar uh, uh, March of the, uh, this year, and uh, we open source uh, 3 billion uh, multi-modality models and uh, uh, that's open source. And uh, uh, currently we also have even par more powerful uh, multi-modality models with uh, uh, 20 billion parameters. We, know, uh, we also have the AIGC models uh, given the uh, language description to generate uh, image and videos. And also we have the model for the decision uh, decision making using that natural language to make the decision, uh, do the planning, uh, to solve uh, a lot of open uh, open problems. So these uh, uh, AGM models they will cover the computer vision, uh, natural language processing, uh, multi-model, and uh, the AIGC, and also decision making uh, different uh, aspects. And uh, in order to uh, accomplish this, it uh, need uh, very powerful uh, infrastructures. And uh, so in Shanghai Lingang, we build up uh, uh, a powerful uh, computing cluster with uh, 6,000 uh, uh, petaflops and uh, computation power. And now it can simultaneously, uh, simultaneously uh, training uh, 20 uh, foundation model with, with uh, parameters like uh, uh, 100 uh, billion, uh, these kind of levels. And also this, uh, uh, based on this, it will uh, train the language model and uh, the AIGC model, the, the uh, multi-modality model, and uh, the di digital human, and uh, a large uh, uh, 3D uh, space uh, reconstruction, and a 3D uh, object reconstruction, uh, different uh, uh, model size. Here is an uh, example that uh, we use our uh, uh, language model we call SenseChat, which uh, has uh, 123 billion parameters. And uh, uh, we have a lot of different uh, benchmarks. And uh, we compare uh, this uh, SenseChat uh, with uh, ChatGPT uh, and also GPT-4, uh, so Llama 2. And uh, here uh, y you can see that uh, this SenseChat uh, they will uh, auto perform the chat GPT and uh, also it can approach uh, GPT-4 uh, on uh, certain uh, benchmarks and uh, also uh, at a certain uh, dimensions. And uh, so we hope that uh, we, uh, we will reach the uh, uh, GPT-4 level uh, uh, by the end of this year. And also uh, we are, uh, this language model uh, can support a, a long context window with uh, 32, uh, uh, 32K uh, tokens. Uh, basically, it means that you can give the long input uh, to the language model. For example, you can give the article or even a book and uh, uh, as input to this, uh, uh, this model. Or you have the hundreds of rounds of dialogue as input uh, to this uh, uh, language model. So this language model can take a long, longer input and can have the more com comprehensive uh, under understanding. Because uh, previously the language model only have the 2K uh, 
uh, token length uh, as the context uh, input, but now it's uh, significantly uh, improved. Here example, we take the uh, one paper uh, as the input and then this, uh, you can ask uh, any question uh, to the model uh, uh, regarding to this, uh, uh, this paper. And also this uh, uh, can be used, uh, um, uh, let's see, uh, can be uh, uh, used as uh, uh, improved programming and uh, it can uh, improve the efficiency of the uh, programming at 27% uh, uh, and also on the benchmark, the human evil uh, benchmark, uh, it's can the, the one time, uh, the one pass a successful rate uh, of this our model is 68%, uh, which means that uh, you write uh, 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 the code and uh, on the 60% of uh, uh, the, the chance is completely correct. And uh, so this uh, uh, have the similar performance as the GPT-4. And uh, we are uh, currently our programmers using this uh, to improve the efficiency. We also uh, uh, promote this uh, to our customers. And this uh, language model can also be used uh, work as an AI operation system and uh, it can uh, control other functions, other apps, uh, because it uh, has uh, uh, very strong the, uh, the re uh, reasoning, decision-making capabilities. And uh, also for the AIGC, we have the sense of mirage and uh, to use uh, based on the uh, test input to gener uh, generate the visual content, we keep improve the performance and uh, the capacity of this uh, uh, AIGC model. Here you can uh, see uh, we have the different uh, versions and uh, the quality of the image has been improved uh, significantly. And uh, for the AIGC, we know that uh, it's very important to uh, uh, design the prompt as uh, the input. And uh, so uh, the uh, professional prompt will uh, be able to generate even higher quality image. But usually the, uh, the normal users, they don't know how to really, how to, uh, uh, to make the professional prompts. Uh, for example, on the left side, and uh, we give the uh, input from the, uh, our, our normal users. And uh, based on our language model, the is the capability, it will uh, uh, automatically uh, expand uh, the simple, uh, input a prompt uh, to the more professional one, and uh, then it can uh, generate uh, much higher quality images. And also, uh, given a few images of uh, uh, myself, and uh, we as the input of the model, I uh, can generate a special model for myself. Uh, here, I give the example. I uh, um, give the 20 uh, uh, pictures of myself and uh, trained Laura and uh, uh, which is a specialized model for me. And then uh, you can input uh, the text to generate uh, my images uh, in the future, or even my videos on the different uh, scenarios automatically, uh, which is uh, quite, uh, quite useful. And uh, this, um, uh, this is uh, 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 the product we promote uh, in the, uh, in uh, in Germany auto show, uh, so uh, basically uh, uh, the human can uh, draw the the sketch. You can see uh, this uh, uh, the outlier uh, the con uh, the sketch, and also can, can you can uh, give the input uh, what kind of uh, uh, picture you want to generate. And based on the sketch and the text description, and this model can uh, generate high quality uh, uh, the, the images. And this will be uh, quite interesting uh, for a lot of the normal users for them uh, to, uh, to, to create uh, beautiful uh, pictures. And also for the uh, multi-model uh, foundation model, and uh, so give the image and uh, you can ask uh, uh, using uh, language description to describe the, any task, to ask uh, any question regarding to this image. It will uh, have the very rich uh, description and the feedback about the image content. Yeah. Uh, 
So we also uh, have the open source uh, program uh, for smaller foundation model uh, like the 7, uh, 7, uh, 7B or, or 13B uh, parameters and uh, we open source to the public and uh, it has a high performance and also can uh, help uh, the uh, research community and uh, to, uh, to explore a lot of uh, applications. And then uh, uh, the last part, I will quickly uh, see a few, uh, for example, in the uh, autonomous uh, uh, smart vehicle and uh, how this uh, uh, the EGI foundation mo model uh, can improve the uh, autonomous driving and the intelligent camping uh, with the AI as a cloud service. For example, for the smart camping, um, uh, we hope that uh, it can become a smart travel assistant. And uh, because inside the car, there's a lot of sensors, and uh, this uh, multimodal uh, large language uh, large model can uh, combine uh, these uh, different uh, uh, types of uh, signals uh, to uh, com comprehensively understand the need of the passengers. And uh, this um, uh, language model can serve as the brain of the campaign. Uh, to control uh, different uh, devices, uh, applications uh, inside of the car. And also for each uh, passenger or the driver, uh, we, have to, we can have the uh, uh, memory, and uh, uh, this memory can be attached uh, as a document attached to the uh, foundation model. And this, uh, then this uh, uh, foundation model can be uh, personalized, uh, have the uh, personalize the uh, uh, interaction uh, service uh, for individual person. And also the AIGC model can uh, help to uh, create uh, the customized digital human. And uh, this, uh, uh, this uh, uh, can be bring, uh, will uh, uh, be able to connect with uh, on the vehicle side and uh, receive a lot of uh, different types of the signals and uh, to uh, to have them uh, connect with the memory models and uh, to under, uh, understand the status of the vehicle. And uh, on the cloud, we have a lot of foundation models uh, to, to empower this, uh, this, uh, uh, this brain. And uh, then uh, at the application level, it can support a lot of applications on the safety, uh, entertainment, education, and the efficiency. And uh, based on the foundation models, so we uh, have developed a lot of uh, uh, interesting applications. And uh, here I give you the, uh, one, a few examples. Uh, one example is like uh, we use it uh, as a um, uh, health uh, consultant. So basically inside the uh, campaign, uh, we use a sensor. Uh, we uh, can uh, measure the breath rate, the, the, uh, the blood pressure, uh, a lot of uh, uh, measures from the uh, from the uh, the passengers such as difficulty breathing dizziness and so on feeling a bit tightness in the chest oh, yeah. having trouble and, uh, breathing then, uh, then this uh, foundation, uh, foundation model can proactively uh, kind of uh, uh, start initiate the conversation with the passenger uh, so if the passenger need uh, the the help uh, help to do the calling, uh, to have the emergency call, and uh, or stop the car. Or it can provide a lot of consultant uh, uh, regarding to the, the, the health to help the passengers. And uh, this is another uh, example as uh, the travel assistance. Today is July the 7th, and the weather is clear. Do you want to know what significant events have You can summarize the, the news of the, the on that day. Hours. Sure. Tell me about it. The world and the, uh, if you want to go to uh, uh, to the certain destination, and uh, then it will automatically uh, generate the travel plan for you. And uh, the foundation model also can automatically call the ABP uh, to book the hotel, uh, flight tickets, and uh, uh, for you. Just uh, you just need to confirm with it. I've selected the most suitable hotels in terms of price and distance for your chosen dates. If everything looks good, please face the screen and say, confirm. Confirm. 
And uh, during the, the, the travel, and uh, you have uh, uh, take a lot of nice pictures and uh, videos, and uh, this uh, this model can automatically and uh, uh, help you to generate the vlog and uh, to, uh, to to help you to, to distribute uh, with your friends, share with your friends. Please assist me in creating a travel vlog. Certainly, make sure to Photoshop me into some of the landscapes as well. It's all set and. And lastly, for the autonomous driving, and uh, you know this, uh, uh, in the uh, last month, uh, Tesla announced that uh, they using a single uh, neural network to establish uh, autonomous driving. Because uh, previously there are several different modules uh, like uh, perception, uh, planning, control, uh, fusion, etc. And uh, only the perception part is based on the neural network. So the other, other parts are based on the rules and uh, you have to hard code a lot of things. Uh, but um, uh, with a single uh, neural network, uh, currently uh, people can uh, have the end-to-end -end autonomous driving. It uh, will be all will be uh, driven by uh, massive data, and uh, it's also require this uh, 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 one of the important application of the foundation models. So for this end-to-end -end driving, we can see that the performance at each individual uh, different uh, modules has been uh, improved a lot. And uh, so with the foundation model, so you can only, uh, we can establish the autonomous driving only based on the cameras and uh, also without the required high definition map. And uh, it also have the good uh, uh, interoperability uh, uh, interpretation uh, capability and the safety, we can also upgrade uh, the model uh, uh, efficiently. And uh, so uh, this uh, uh, foundation model, the AGI, uh, will be very powerful to uh, empower the intelligent vehicle. Uh, so we have a, a good intelligence uh, driving uh, experience. And this is only the uh, one of the example of uh, uh, AGI in the uh, uh, industry vertical. Uh, actually, currently we are apply this uh, to a lot of uh, uh, industry domains, and uh, uh, they uh, give us a high uh, expectation. And uh, we hope that uh, we can uh, uh, a lot of uh, talents work together and uh, to create uh, the, the uh, beautiful uh, future with uh, AGI. Okay, that's uh, the share all my share. Thank you.